Hi everyone, I just want to jump on here and give some tidbits from different meetings and podcasts I've listened to lately that are just bombarding us realtors with all the things to expect in 2022 for the housing market. We actually just had a great presentation by Dr. Lawrence Yun, the Chief Economist for the National Association of Realtors. And these are some of the finer points that I've been hearing across all the different areas that I've been listening to. Uh, number one, and I'll try to temper this with the good news as much as possible. So good news is that we still have plenty of buyers and a lot of people out there interested in purchasing homes, especially with unemployment being at an all time low. And there's about two jobs out there for any every unemployed person. So we still have plenty of people out there, you know, making money and looking to purchase. More good news is that hopefully we'll have more inventory this year. Many of the reports are expecting to have an increase in the selection out there, which can really help out some of you buyers that have been not, not been able to find what you've been looking for. Uh, good news for homeowners and sellers is that prices are still expected to stay pretty high. Uh, hopefully we'll see a little bit of leveling off with that. We have seen cooling in some of the areas around here still some competitive offers and multiple offers, but people aren't quite bidding as much over asking price as uh, they were at the height of 2021, which was really crazy. Um, none of the reports that I've been listening to are predicting any kind of major correction. Uh, some people are kind of waiting around to jump in for that, but so far, if um, somebody's in default or foreclosure, generally they've got enough equity in their home where they can actually sell it rather than go into default. So um, they're still happening, but it's not going to be anything, a major dip um, as far as any of the reports that I've been listening to. Um, now for a little bit more of the bad news is uh, actually one of the biggest quotes that caught so much attention this morning in our update from Dr. Yun was that inflation is actually at the highest it's been in 40 years. And Basically, the days of 3% or less, uh, under 3% interest rates for mortgages are done. So we are already over 3% here in the beginning of 2022. One report I heard expects there to be about four rate hikes throughout the year. And Dr. Yun thought that maybe by the end of the year, we'd be as high as 3.8%. Uh, so that is going to make it a little tougher for some buyers to uh, purchase a home. It may sellers make your houses sit a little bit longer, um, but hopefully things will balance out. And just keep in mind, the good news is these are still great interest rates. Every meeting I go to is talks about way back when, when they were is 18% for a mortgage. So uh, I don't balk at these interest rates. They're still low. They're lower than they were four years ago. So they're still really great rates. Um, I, I will mention that if you are in the market for a second home, those rates have actually jumped a lot, like astronomically. So th if you're thinking about that, give me a call. I'll connect you with a great lender. Um, you can ask all the questions that you need, but if you're an investor thinking about buying a second home, they're, yeah, those rates have definitely uh, gone up quite a bit. And the last thing I want to end on for good news is that real estate is a great investment still to protect yourself against all this inflation and higher interest rates and things like that. So if you're an investor, you own property, you're a homeowner, you're thinking about jumping in, it's really still one of the most solid and best investments that you can make. So if you have any questions about this or you want to know more information, just please reach out to me. I, you can message me here or you can email me at fawn at teamregency.com. Thanks for listening.